Pendleton. <laughs> Hi everybody, this is Mitzi with Mitz Adventures. This is kind of a test. Uh, I think it's probably too early to post yet because um, I look kind of dark still and, and I noticed a lot of my posts are dark. So um, we'll wait just a little bit. It's only 6.30 in the morning. Okay, first we do the toast. That's pretty good toast. I sprayed it with my um my butter spray. I can't believe it's not butter. Spray. Yeah. That's the kind of butter I like to get anyway. I can't believe it's not butter. It's good stuff. So I'm making my toast first. Okay. So I think my toast is done. And yeah, it's good enough. So I got my two pieces of toast. Now the next step is a treat. Because I don't get this very often, but I'm actually going to put oil in the pan. Not a lot. Not a lot of oil. But uh, I got hash browns from my son. So I'm going to have scrambled eggs and hash browns this morning. And for hash browns, I like them crispy. So I had to put some oil in. Notice the sun's coming out. I think it's about 7.10 now. But I'll let that warm up a little bit. Don't want to put it in cold oil. So step two is going to be my hash browns. Ooh, wee. Hash browns. Can't help it. I like it crispy. Gotta have oil for that. Okay, I think, am I recording Hell's Bells? I don't know. Yeah, I am. Okay, this is done. <laughs> crunchy. Crunchy, crunchy. I'll put it on a napkin, but that's crunchy. I got a little too much oil in here. So I'm going to pour that out into a container I have standing by. Hope it doesn't melt through. And then I like to uh, cook up my, on my uh, uh, bacon bits a little bit. Make them a little crispy. So I'll put those in there. And... Put the onions in there. Oops, turn it down a little. Bacon bits will pop. That's why I put a lid on for the bacon bits. Why this is so dark. I wonder if... Nope, doesn't help at all. Okay. I'll get my onions open. Gosh darn, this container is crazy. Okay, onions. Yeah. Onions, good, good stuff. And then we got to put a lid on this one because the bacon bits will pop at you. So there goes the lid and we let that cook for a while. And then when it's done, we add the eggs to it and the cheese at the last. And we have scrambled eggs. Okay, 
That looks good. Smells good. And uh, now comes the fun part, trying to crack the egg without getting it all over me, which I've never done yet. Without getting it all over me. Oh, there's one. Did pretty good on that one. And... This one's going to give me a hard time. There's two. And I still have my little napkin here so I can get all the egg off my hands. And then we got to mix it all up because it's going to be scrambled today. I just felt like scrambled with cheese. Haven't had that in a while. So we're doing some scrambling. Get some of that good pepper in there. Eee, love pepper. Mm, mm, mm. I think I better turn it up or it's going to take forever. <sighs> and the cheese goes in last, of course. But I just keep uh, mixing it. Once, it's, once I know it's all cooked, because I hate gooey. I mean, the white gooey, you know. Once I know it's all cooked, then I add the cheese and let it melt into it. Okay, that looks pretty done. So now, I put the cheese in. I like lots of cheese on it. And then we start mixing that in and let it melt into it. Oh yeah, there you go. You gotta be a little bit patient, but it don't take long. Pretty soon you have cheese and bacon and onions all mixed together. And you have cheesy scrambled eggs. When you use American cheese, it's more creamy looking, I guess. But I like the cheddar. Uh, what I usually get is the Colby Monterey Jack mix. That's what I have. I don't even have cheddar in it. It's Colby and Monterey Jack. And it's good. There you go. And here we have it. This is my uh, full breakfast. Scrambled eggs with cheese, so they're real kind of creamy and soft. Uh, toast, hash browns. <laughs> See, they're crispy. I like them that way. And coffee. Nice breakfast to start the day. Beautiful Saturday morning here. I think it's Saturday. Pretty sure it is. Okay, here we go with starting the day. I'm going to eat, and you guys can just make your own breakfast. <laughs> well, as you can see, I enjoyed my breakfast thoroughly. <laughs> uh, I made two pieces of toast because... Um, since this was going to be like a restaurant breakfast, I always got two pieces of toast and the la the second piece I always put jelly on. But I'm so full, I don't want any more. So this, I'm going to save and I'll just stick it on my burner and crisp it up again. Uh, maybe for lunch I'll have jelly on it because I do like it that way. But yeah, I'm full. <laughs> that was a lot of food. It's funny how just hash browns, adding hash browns made a difference, but it did. Okay, so now we're going to start the day off. I got a few surprises for you. Oh, I ought to show you what I did. Um, of course, I took them all down because I was cooking. 
One of the nice things about not using American cheese also is uh, it don't stick. American cheese always did stick when I try to make scrambled uh, cheese e eggs. But uh, the um, other cheeses, they have more oil in them or something, and they just slide right up. So uh, all I have to do with this is uh, take a napkin and wipe it out, and it's clean. I can't do it with one hand, but basically that's what I do. Okay, so what I ended up doing was my clothes are on the little metal one, hanging up just fine. They're so wrinkled, I've got to figure out a way to, because <laughs> they've been folded in a bag. Um, but, you know, that's still going to work. And uh, this is going to be for my frying pans and everything, and it works wonderfully also. And what I did for traveling is I take one of these and I wrap it around all of this, you know, the handles. I usually have three. And then, and then I hang them on here, and then I take this and put it down like that on each one. And that keeps them from flying off and from banging around and stuff. Um, so it's working out perfectly and it's right next to where I cook. So that's what I did with that. And once again, I'm gonna show you the other thing I decided to do since I've been unable to find a decent park that's close and I'm using all my gas up trying to find a park so I gave up on that idea so I have a new th plan that I decided to do while I'm here and I'll let you know about that in a minute okay this is the end of the video for today I know I had one more thing to tell you about I didn't realize how long this video was so um it rained so I couldn't really show you what I wanted to show you anyway uh, the sun's out now but it's the end of the day. It came out just in time to go under again. <laughs> but um, I'll show you that tomorrow. So stay tuned. And I hope you enjoyed my food video for today. Everybody stay happy. I love you all. I love you, Patty. And uh, follow your bliss. Bye.